Have you often been called too sensitive in life? And do you often feel like an alien because you stay at home while your friends go out partying and living wildly at the weekend? Then chances are high that you have a highly sensitive personality, HSP. Welcome to today's episode. My name is Robert and today I'm going to share with you five traits of a highly sensitive personality. According to Dr. Elaine and Aaron, around 20% of all people have what is known as a sensory processing sensitivity. This means that their nervous system enables a particularly strong perception and processing of stimuli. The following five traits are very typical for an HSP personality. Number one, enormous profoundness and depth. As an HSP, you've probably noticed that you somehow think differently and more deeply about the world than others. Highly sensitive people have a fantasy-filled inner life. They really enjoy withdrawing into themselves and to them it's necessary to take periods when they are just to themselves to process and categorize the stimuli of the outside world. Number two, high moral and ethical understanding. Is the welfare of all living beings very important to you? Would you never kill an animal yourself? And do you not even turn on the news anymore because you only react with shock and disbelief to the events shown such as war? Then you share another trait of an HSP. This also includes the strong expressions of the values, honesty, justice and loyalty. Number three, a proneness to anxiety and depression. According to the research of Dr. Aaron, especially the high need for security of the nervous system of highly sensitive people is responsible for that. So there seems to be a connection between an accumulation of anxiety and depression states with highly sensitive personalities. As highly sensitive people, we are therefore called upon to deal more with ourselves and our inner world. And I know from my own experience how much strong emotions and anxiety can tear you apart. However, I also see it from a different, more positive perspective. I believe that exactly this occupation with ourselves is also the way into a deep insight into life, which can bring us a lot of relief and freedom as well. Number four, perception of details. You notice that your partner has cut off a strand of her or his hair, or that your mother has a new lamp in the hallway. You have a special feeling about aesthetics and hygiene and find only certain traits in potential partners attractive. Then you certainly have a very fine perception. And number five, a high level of compassion. If you have such a high level of compassion that you even cry along with movies, then your perception is very sensitive. Many highly sensitive people have a very particularly strong empathy as well. Through this strength, they have the ability to put themselves in the shoes of others very well. And this makes them especially loved by other people, such as friends, family members, or their partners as exceptionally good listeners. So could you recognize yourself in these five characteristics as well? Then you might have an HSP personality. If so, definitely let me know in the comments or in the FAQ section. And if you don't want to miss any upcoming episodes, feel free to subscribe to the podcast here on iTunes, Spotify, YouTube, wherever you listen. And before I forget, I also started a book list. So I put the best books I've read about the topics such as high sensitivity here in the podcast description. Also, feel free to check them out and I see you in the next episode.